What's going on everybody? I'm Seth with MK Carpet Cleaning and it is June the 2nd and in this very very brief video I'm going to show you our process for a clean and buff. Now this is different from a clean and recoat because in the clean and recoat there's a couple of other steps we have to add. So again this is just a process we use for cleaning and buffing of hardwood floors. The first process is always a good thorough vacuuming uh, in which we uh, remove as much of the dry soil as we possibly can. And in the second process, we uh, will begin using our auto scrubber, which is a, uh, um, a scrubber you'll see here in just a minute. It uh, allows us to put solution in and then uh, remove the solution almost immediately after it's put down on the floor. And in this process, we use a product that is called IFT, which is Intensive Floor Treatment, which is a high pH product. And the reason why we use this is it helps remove a lot of the grease, oil, dirt, and stuff that may be on the hardwood floors that typically can't be removed with traditional cleaning. And um, the only issue with that is you have to neutralize it after you clean it. So we have to go over the floors again. And typically we use the auto scrubber again with the neutral product, which uh, we either use Squeaky Clean or Zips Neutral Floor Cleaner. Both are almost identical and uh, they both do the same process which is kind of neutralize the floors and help uh, uh, clean them. And the reason why you want to neutralize them is because if you leave them in a high pH it helps attract future soil. So that's an important process you don't want to skip. After we do that we will go over the floors with the white pad and our 175. And the reason we do that is typically if you clean hardwood floors, especially if you use a high pH product, it kind of leaves the floors dull afterwards. And so what the white pad and the 175 do, as you're seeing now in the video, is they help buff out the floors, help bring out that natural finish that's already in the floors, and just helps give them an overall good shine. If you go back to the very front of the video, you'll see the first picture of the floors kind of look dull, and, um, and in the second picture, you'll notice they kind of pop a little bit and uh, have a nice, uh, uh, nice shine to them. And that's the reason why we use the 175, um, kind of, again, it helps... Uh, buff out the floors and get that natural shine to it. So anyway, I'm going to quit rambling here. This is pretty much the end of the video anyway. Thanks so much for watching. If you have any questions or comments, text us 336-465-6120 or you can leave us a message here on our social media platforms.